Phillips bought us. We were half, halfway through this program. We had created this light bulb. I talked to my CEO about it, and I said, I'd like to put this out there. The Lamps Group called me a day later and said, well, we're Lamps. You're not. We own it. So you want to give it to us? I said, that's great. Uh, are you going to market it? Well, no, we don't think it's the right time. We, we think it's too expensive. And I said, well, I have a... Um, I have a lighting designer specifier on the West Coast who bought 50,000 lamps for his project that he's doing. And it's a little, sort of a little pause in the end of the phone. And, well, we, don't, we still don't think it makes sense. For, uh, <laughs> and I said, I said, okay, well, we're, we're not getting anywhere here, but we want to build it. And so I went back to, to the CEO and I said, what if we give them all the profits from the lamp? We'll make it, we'll design it, and we'll cover, recover our costs, and we'll give all the profits to the lamps group. So he laughed and he said, try it. And so I went back and I called the guy again, I'm not going to name him. And I said, we'll build the lamp and uh, we'll, we'll give it to you at cost. You keep all the profits. Uh, how does that sound? It's this long pause. And it's like, he's trying to find out, is there's a trick here? <laughs> what are you talking about? And he said, well, all right, all right, fine. And so we put a line up in Shanghai to build it. Nice. And I got a call from my product manager. I still remember it was very late at night. And uh, she was almost in tears. And she said, Phillips is here and they're shutting down the line. Wait, what? Yeah. After, after oh, all that, that, after their agreement. And I, I said a few choice words. And I said, let me make some calls. But they, they ended up shutting down the line. And at that point, and it was almost two years into it, I, I realized I would be leaving. And that was yeah. the attitude, would that attitude. Any person, I think, to resign. Because you, you, we already had LED products in the market. We were selling, you know, close to a hundred million dollars a year in LED lighting systems. We knew there was a market. We knew it would grow. We also, because it was a semiconductor process, I had done a, quite a bit of study a few years earlier to show when that crossover point would occur. Only I was wrong. It happened faster than I predicted. <laughs> uh, because the performance of the lamps continued to grow. The, the lumens per watt, the cost per, uh, for, per lumen continued to drop precipitously. And the quality of the light was getting close to equaling that or bettering that of traditional lamps. So was the concern that it just threatened the existing product line? Yes, absolutely. Okay. There is no doubt. Yeah. 